Hey, it's Matt. We're back. In this uh, module, we're talking about deployment with Mage. And in this specific video, we're going to make sure that we have all the Google Cloud permissions that we need uh, to run our Mage project. And so I'm going to list these off in the uh, GitHub uh, like information page on the Zoom camp. Uh, but the permissions we need is artifact registry read, artifact registry write, um, Google Cloud Run developer permission, Cloud SQL, and then the service account token creator. Um, and so I'm going to take you to where you can configure these, make sure they exist um, and shouldn't be too difficult. But if we go to IAM and admin in the Google Cloud uh, dashboard, um, we're going to head to um, the service account that we're using. Uh, so this uh, compute service account, I'm almost positive, is the this is the default um, and the mage zoom camp service account I'm using uh, is this guy down here. So um, Probably not a uh, ideal practice, um, but my service account does have a lot of excess permissions because I declared it as a owner. So if you simply select owner in your service account, this will work, I can confirm that. Um, but if you want to be very granular, um, you can select individual con conditions. Um, so we could do like search for artifact registry reader. Uh, for example, we could add uh, artifact registry writer. The other role we'd be looking for, I believe, is cloud run developer. We need cloud SQL admin. And we need a uh, service account token creator. So if you have owner listed on your service account, that'll take care of everything. Otherwise, the other permissions you'll need if you want to do the very the most basic permissions possible, artifact registry reader, artifact registry writer, cloud run developer, cloud SQL admin, service account token creator. So once you have these set, you click save, you should be able to do everything you need to deploy um, our Terraform scripts. Uh, this assumes that you have Terraform installed and assumes you have Google Cloud CLI installed. Um, in the next video, I'm going to talk about pulling down the Mage Terraform uh, templates and we're going to get running with, up and running with those.